So from the Worcester novices to the Berkshire novices chase, another grade two event over two miles and four furlongs. The long applause for Joshua Southern, William the Conqueror, Leon Van Rensburg, the Ice King for Leon Van Rensburg, Adelina for John Morgan, Fergus Falls and Aaron Thompson, Glory Be Drama for David Ladd, along with Cariani Flip, Lanelli, Lanelli Saltine for Thomas Rogers, Magic Girl for David Hooley, Ozark Slipper for Vinnie Gerard, Wild Neat and Young Ones for Hems Make Up 12. Just over two and a half miles here. It's G2 novices event. Star's got him away. Let's see who can win this one. Pushing along in front. It's a big grey Avellino for John Morgan. It's going to take them to the first of the 16. Fences they've got to take here. The one that's running it down is Ice King. Which, if I'm not mistaken, is a pace set up for William the Conqueror. We'll get over the first. They're all over it. The one that took it really bad was Ozark Slipper. Did dive into the ground on landing, jumps the second a little bit better. So it's Avellino from the Ice King, the Long Pools, William the Conqueror, Lanelli Soltane, over the third. Large jump at the rear by Young Ones. So Avellino giving the Ice King a little bit of pressure here. His pace making duties. Get over that this time. There's a poor jump, I think, again. Not Ozark Slipper again. He's going to have trouble if he, yeah. Continues to jump like that. So as they get to the fifth, the water. And they'll jump over that big slow jump in mid pack by Magic Girl. Towards the rear is now Fergus Falls. Out wide are the Hems horses of Wild Neat and Young Ones. We've got Kalani Flip on their inside. Then the green silks of Ozark Slipper who's uh, looking to hang on to his, his jockey. So it's Avelina that leads him past the winning post with a circuit to go. The Ice King in second, the Long Falls is third, William Conqueror is fourth, up against the fence is Lanelli Sultane. Wider those two is Magic Girl and Glory B Drama. They're followed through by Kalani Flip and Wild Neat, Ozark Slipper and Fergus Falls all together. The young ones just bouncing around at the back looking for a bit of room. Not sure where to go as they go over the six. We took that one much better. So, ten fences to take. Avelina from the Ice King. And three back to the long poles, Glory B Drama. He's moved up into fourth on his own from William the Conqueror and Kalani Flip. Lanelli Sultan. Sultan is still up against the fence. But it's still Avellino. The Ice King and the long poles. Easy one, two, three. This time the Ice King gave that plenty of air. He's not jumped particularly well. But he's only there to set the pace. So it's Avellino from the Ice King, the Long Balls. The one, two, three, moving over the ninth. And then the Conqueror's moved into fourth. Wild Needs made up some good ground and moved up into fifth. And the two Robertson horses of Glory B Drama and Callying E Flip. Against the fence still is Lanley Sultane as they go over the tenth. A couple poor jumps there. Slow jump by Magic Girl. So up front is still the same three. Avellino, Ice King and Long Balls. And they're still three or four lengths away from Wild Neat, William the Conqueror, and Fer not Fergus Falls, sorry, Caliani Flip. He's moved into Falls now. He's swing left handed here. Nice big and wide Newbury. So Avellino from the Ice King. Long Falls moves up alongside the Ice King. Trying to take second. Avellino's being pushed along by his jockey now into the 11th. Oh, we've lost one. The Ice King's gone. But it's Avellino and Long Pools that are together up front. And they've got about a four or five length advantage now from Cariani Flip and William the Conqueror. Moving well on the outside is Wild Neat. Pushing through is Fergus Falls now. Wider still and trying to run on his Ozark Slipper. None of these Sultanes moved off the fence. Being followed through by Magic Girl, Young Ones and Glory B Drama at the rear. But up front is still Avellino that leads us as we get down to the final half mile. It's Avellino from Long Pools. Here comes Cariani Flip and Fergus Falls. I'm not sure anything else is going to be in this. But it's Avellino still running on. Well, is Ozark Slipper after some poor jumping as we get down to the final three furlongs? The leader's over it from Caliani Flip. Here comes the William the Conqueror out of the pack. So it's Avellino, Caliani Flip. They start pulling away from Fergus Falls. William the Conqueror is running on. On the outside is the Long Pools, but it's still Avellino. Avellino leads inside the two from William the Conqueror and the Long Pools. They start to pull away from the rest. It's Avellino. Avellino, furlong and a half to go. They go over the last and jumps it well, but the Long Pools jumps it better. The one that's given way is William the Conqueror, and it's Avellino. Avellino from the Long Pools, William the Conqueror there inside the final furlong, and it's Avellino. Here comes 
the long pause. William the Conqueror between horses. Avelina wants the post to come. It's Avelina from long pause and he's outside. William the Conqueror running on Wells Fergus Falls. But it's Avelina that takes it. Well done to John Morgan there. Takes the Berkshire Novices G2 event. From the well touted William the Conqueror, I must say. So it's a good win there. So a win for Avelina and John Morgan. Second was the long pause for. Joshua Sutherland, William the Conqueror was third, fourth was Fergus, Falls for Darren Thompson, fifth was Caliani, flip for Davy Ladd.